This video will demonstrate the standard operating procedures of the APV1000 homogenizer. Before you start, make sure the machine is plugged into the power receptacle. Then turn on the power source to the machine by pushing the lever in. Place the rubber tubing for the water cooling system into a 6-liter Erlenmeyer flask filled halfway with water. Turn on the digital pressure gauge by pressing the on-off button. Zero the gauge if the display is not already displaying zero. Turn both of the hand wheels counterclockwise to open the homogenizing valve. Make sure the homogenizing valve is open prior to running the machine, otherwise damage to both the machine and the operator can occur. Pour your sample into the feed hopper. To start homogenization, first make sure the emergency stop button is pulled out. Then press the green power button on the front of the machine. Once the machine is turned on, your sample will immediately start draining out of the discharge tube before the pressure can be adjusted to the right value. Make sure to place a container underneath to collect the drained sample. If needed, the drained sample can be placed back into the hopper for proper homogenization. Observe the flow of the homogenizer. If the flow pulses steadily, then it's normal. If the flow pulses erratically, then it's abnormal. In this case, allow it to continue pumping in order to expel all the air before moving on to the next step. To activate pressure, turn the first handwheel clockwise very slowly to open the homogenization valve until 60 is displayed on the pressure gauge. Then turn the second handwheel clockwise until desired pressure. The maximum pressure that should be used with the machine is approximately 10,000 psi. Please note, set machine pressure to around 10% below the desired final pressure because pressure will increase during processing. Observe the flow. If flow is consistent, collect samples from the end of the discharge tube. Caution, do not ever let the feed hopper run empty during processing. When the volume of the sample is running low in the feed hopper, add more sample if you wish to continue processing. If not, disengage the pressure before turning off the machine. After sample collection is complete, turn off the homogenization pressure by turning the second hand wheel counterclockwise until the pressure gauge reads 60. Then turn the first hand wheel counterclockwise until the pressure gauge reads 0. After the pressure is shut off, you can clean the instrument by adding in a small amount of ethanol or other food grade solvent that is miscible with your sample and let the homogenizer run until clear liquid flows out. To shut down, first turn off the pressure gauge, then the red power button, and pull the power box lever out. Thank you for watching.